Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So I wanted to share with you guys these adorable canvas bags that I DIY'd for about $2.50. They're super cute and super easy to make and it's perfect. You could just throw on a show on Netflix and just go ahead and make a bag and you can personalize them any way you like and I think they're so adorable and they add so much and they're perfect for your Instagram photos. This one I made and it says Boss Babe and I think it's super cute and bold. And I also made this one and it says ain't no hood like motherhood. I really do hope you guys enjoy this video and if you guys do remake them tag me on Instagram it's at Marcella Veronica underscore. So now we're just gonna go ahead and get started. I picked up my canvas bags at my local Hobby Lobby and it was a little weird because one was $1.99 but another was $2.50 but then they said that the prices are going up so now they're gonna be $2.50. So all I did was I went on Canva and I created this graphic and I printed it out and then I slipped a piece of cardboard inside my canvas bag because I didn't want it to bleed through to the other side. And I will leave this graphic down below so you guys can print it out for free if you'd like. So all I did was I placed the words where I wanted them and I just went over them with a permanent marker so it could bleed through to the canvas bag. Uh, kind of like a transfer. I did try a graphite transfer with the pencil but it did not work. So all I did was I went over the letters over and over until they bled through to the canvas bag. And of course, there's many ways you guys can do this. You can do it with a Cricut machine or with a Silhouette machine with a uh, vinyl transfer, or you can also do like an iron-on transfer if you have that type of paper. Um, anyway, and then I used a Sharpie for the letters. You can also use fabric paint or a paint marker, anything, but I just wanted something bold and quick and cheap and easy just to achieve the look I was going for. Once I did get the letters onto the canvas bag, I went ahead with a fine tip sharpie and I just went over the edges. And then once I was done with the outline, I went ahead with a thicker sharpie and I filled it in. And then when I was done with the thicker sharpie, I went ahead and did the outline again just so it could have crisp edges. So you can get as creative as you want with the sayings and what you want it to say on the canvas bags. I saw some really fun ideas on Pinterest and I am definitely going to be creating more of these, especially for summer when we go to the beach and stuff for the kids. I have some really fun ideas for that. I also saw some little canvas pouches at Hobby Lobby also and I think it would be so smart to personalize them and to get like your purse organized. You can have one that says keys and your keys go in that little pouch. One that says makeup and your makeup goes in that little pouch. You know, just to get your purse more organized and have a cute little canvas bag. As far as caring for the canvas bags and the Sharpie, I don't know what would happen if you throw these in the wash. It's more of just like for the look. Um, but if it does get dirty, I would just spot clean wherever it does get dirty, just so you won't mess up the letters. So I just went ahead and filled in the letters with the thick Sharpie like I did earlier. And once I was done doing that, I went ahead with the thin Sharpie and I just went over the outline one more time to give it the crisp edges. And that is it you guys, it is super simple and super easy. If you guys do try this, let me know in the comments what you guys think. I really do hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you do, don't forget to give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe if you are new here and I will see you guys in my next video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye guys.